Hello everyone. In this paper, we seek to answer the following question. What can we learn by predicting accuracy? Indeed, classification is one of the most popular tasks in machine learning, and many loss functions have been developed to maximize this non-differentiable objective function. Unlike past work on loss function design, which was mainly guided by intuition and, their, uh, and theory before being validated by experimentation, here we propose to approach this problem in the opposite way. We seek to e extract knowledge by experimentation. This data-driven approach is similar to that used in physics to discover general laws from data. Here, we propose to tackle the problem of finding the key components of embeddings leading to better accuracy. This task could help us to better understand the intrinsic mechanism of learning representation. To do so, we propose here to predict the future accuracy of a linear classifier. While the question of predicting the future accuracy may look odd at the first glance, this has been used with success in several applications in machine learning, such as neural architecture search. Here, however, we are interested by finding solutions which, which are highly explainable. Our pipeline consists in few steps. The first one is to project all the data sets we are trying to, to study into a shared space of representation. This is done by describing each data set with a set of statistics, here 19. We studied here more than 260 data sets of embeddings. By using a symbolic regression approach, we are able to build a mathematical formula which has been found to be highly correlated with the accuracy. Interestingly, we found our formula to be highly competitive by being comparable to a random forest using 10 trees and the 19 variables. Our formula used only five variables and a single formula. Furthermore, with a high correlation of 96%, our formula is able to provide a solution which is highly interpretable, explainable, and correlate a lot with, with all the findings in the literature. For example, in Terralia, we found our formula able to reconstruct the Fisher ratio used in the LDA. This could be interpreted such as a separability criterion. If you are interested, let's have a talk. You can drop us an email or come see us at the poster number 1331. Thanks for your attention.